it's hard because everybody knows if you get a note wrong. Physiologically, I, my whole body is affected. Um, some people love being front and centre, star of the show, that's not me. You know, it's not about the band behind me that knows if I'm going to play a bad note. It's not about me, it's about them. I remember that the very, very first bugle call that I did was in a, a country town and I was terrified. There was probably 20 or 30 people around the Cenotaph, really tiny service, but full of people who, for whom it was really meaningful. So it was their relatives, their, you know, their family members' names on the Cenotaph behind us. And I realised, looking across the street, about half a block again, there was an old man who was wearing medals but who couldn't join the group. And so I directed the bugle and I, played, I bounced it off the wall behind him. And that gave me a focus and, and the meaning. We've developed over the last couple of years a, a fantastic partnership, both with RSO Tasmania, but the Royal Australian Navy Band. Both of those partners are central to us delivering a really memorable and genuine moment of reflection prior to the game starting. And I love the fact that my job is to frame that minute silence so that whatever you need as a listener to think about, I'm not distracting from that.